and welcome to the Brewers Advent Calendar. My name is Martin. I'm a beer blogger from Austria. Please check out my channel on YouTube. ProBeer.tv is the name and I'm following the Brewers Advent Calendar with some beers. I really fell in love and um, today we got a very very special beer of a brewery you might never heard of. Um, the brewery is called Zwönitze which is uh, named after the city the brewery is located in. And actually Zwönitzer is a brew pub. It's a tiny small brewery. And today you got their Rauchbier um, in a can. I got this beer first uh, two years ago um, and I immediately fell in love with this beer. Um, this beer made it to five of five points in my uh, personal rating. And I'm really interested uh, how the beer makes in a can. Um, I know some of you uh, might skip now uh, as Rauchbier is not your favorite style of beer, but give this one a try. Probably some of you might know the uh, Schlenkerla beer from uh, Bavaria, which is completely famous in, in the US. And um, it has such an intense uh, bacon smoky flavor. This is a lot smoother. Um, at least it should be a lot smoother. Um, I only had it uh, from the bottle and it might, might be different in the can today. Um, the alcohol of this one is 5.0 um, ABV, um, 13 degree plateau and 30 bitter units on the IBU scale. Um, you should have this one a little bit warmer. The brewery suggests it uh, to be consumed at around 11 degrees Celsius, which means um, 51 degrees Fahrenheit on your scale. Um, the hops they used with this one was um, German Tettnanger and Southern Cross. Um, I don't know very much about the, the malt they used. For sure there should be smoked malt in it. Let's pour it in the glass and you see a lot of foam here. Very, very intense foam, but it disappears quite quickly, but then it reveals a nice brownish mahogany, creamy, foamy head. And after some of the foam disappears, the rest of it is really lasting. Very, very dense foam on the top, very creamy. And not even move. Look, I move the glass and the foam is not even moving. It's like, like cream on top. Wow, that's huge. And I can remember this was the same with the beer from a bottle. So let's put the nose in. Oh, it's exactly the same. I love that one. I was so surprised two years ago, but it's, it's like smoked bacon, um, smoked malt, a little bit of wood, ah, oh, um, this uh, smoked cheese, ah, oh, that's really intense, but it's not as intense as you might know from the, 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 the Schlenkerla beer. It's very, very uh, smooth and mm, yeah, I just love it. So uh, let's give it a try. Cheers. Yeah. To be honest, um, w when you look for, for, for Rauchbier, it's very hard to find a beer that um, you can say they really nailed the style. Um, you have those extreme versions like the Schlenkerla I mentioned several times before, but these are the extreme ones. But um, to convince somebody who's never been into Rauchbier, um, you need uh, really um, a smoother one. Um, a more decent version. And this one of Zwönitz really, really nails the style of Rauchbier. It's um, ham, it's bacon, um, it's smoked uh, malt, it's burned wood somehow, a little bit of caramel. Um, it has roasted malt in it. All the, 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 the variety of, of flavors you can expect from a Rauchbier, it's in there, but it's on a very, very balanced level. So it's not slapping your face uh, with, the, with the bacon, with the, with the smoked malt, but 
it has all the flavors but on a very very smooth and um, enjoyable uh, way so um, this is really my favorite uh, style um, or my, my favorite uh, Rauchbier so far I had and I'm really happy that they made um, uh, that they, this flavor made it to the to the can uh, and got transported now to you guys. The beer is medium budded, um, has a medium intense carbonation, um, has a silky oily mouth feel, anything you you would um, imagine from from a regular uh, Rauchbier. Um, Oh, the maltiness and the, 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 the smoked malt is just so so intense on the one side but so well balanced with the, the, um, with the whole beer. Uh, I really was worried, to, to be honest, I really was worried um, if the, the, the canned version can make it uh, to, the, to the bottled version and just when I put my nose in it totally convinced me that they really made it um, and uh, the can really preserves all the aromas, all the uh, complexity of this beer. And what is so nice about this beer is, in the in the aftertaste, um, it has some some hoppy bitterness coming through. Uh, it has 30 IBUs, so it's not not that bitter, but um, there's still some 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 bitterness coming through. Um, the, 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 the ham, bacon, smoked aroma just makes a little step back and makes um, a little bit space for some, some sweet um, notes, some sweet aromas, a little bit of caramel. So this beer has quite a, um, uh, a different end than it started with. So um, this is quite a good uh, example for an entry Rauchbier. Um, if you never had a rauch beer before and to introduce somebody into that style of beer. So again, like two years ago, uh, I rated this one with a full five of five points and again I give uh, five points to the Zwönitzer Rauch beer from Saxony in Germany. Um, very, very nice brewery. If you ever got the chance to come to the Erzgebirge where this brewery is located, it's in the area of Dresden. Um, please check their beers out. They should be uh, available in stores. Uh, maybe you can check out the uh, Kalea online store uh, for their other beers. They're really, really good. Um, from the Amber Lager to the Stout to the Whiskey Stout, um, they really, really do good beers in um, uh, this brewery in Saxony. So um, please do not forget to rate this beer at the beertasting.club app. Uh, leave your comments in the comments box of YouTube, Facebook or wherever you see this video. And um, I will be back. Uh, please subscribe to the channel. Um, mostly of my channel is in German, but um, some videos are in English. There are some more to follow during this Christmas season. And stay tuned with the Brewers Advent Calendar and such great beers like the Zwönitzer Rauchbier. My name is Martin and I say cheers to you all, enjoy and cheers!